What's up, guys? You want to see something cool? We have a lot of work to be done in here, but look how fantastic this is. The lighting's pretty good already. And I get this giant door. I have a lot of plans for this. Um, I think I'm gonna put the craftsman's tree over there, and there's a hole in the ceiling right here. I'm gonna put a slide. I also got some stairs. Ooh, where do they go? Oh, my phone light. Yeah. I have a whole attic up here. There's honestly just so much room to do activities. It's definitely gonna take a little bit of TLC. Maybe a little bit of fixing of the AC. Oh my God, guys, look. I have couplets out here. That's DC. I'm out of abbreviation jokes. <laughs> progress on the crack corner. I did all the demolition. I took everything off the wall. I decided instead of doing drywall, Flash now we're going to Lowe's to get some drywall and electrical supplies. Okay, time to move this. Oh. Hey guys, so I had a drywall guy come and he actually said that I bought the wrong drywall. So now I'm we're reloading my truck. And we're gonna return it to Lowe's. End of flashback. We decided to get corrugated sheet metal and then we're just gonna put it up on the wall. It's gonna be badass. This is how the wall turned out so far. That is absolutely beautiful. Now we're gonna insulate the rest of this and put metal sheets all up. Okay guys, so all the corrugated metal is all done. And it looks like the inside of a giant tuna can in here. So now, it's time to get painting. It looks really good. I don't want to toot my own horn, but I think I did a really good job painting this. So now, in turn, do you know what the next step is? We're moving all this junk, right? We're moving all this junk. Okay, we're gonna take a little break on putting together the craft corner desk uh, because the ceiling tiles came in. Yeah, that'll uh, do it. Do you want my YouTube <laughs> Okay, and uh, back to putting this thing together. So one improvement that I wanna make to the desk is these guys. <laughs> These are called caster wheels. I got this case of them for like ten dollars at a yard sale. I know it says twelve right there, but he gave me a deal on them. So first things first, we're gonna have to flip this guy over. Watch out, he's fucking heavy. Okay, ready? Yeah. And now we just start screwing on the casters. Now we just gotta do that eight more times. Okay, all the casters are on. Oh boy. I like it. We now have the island back, and I can move it wherever I want. Okay. Michael here is uh, putting some screws in each corner for me. But I'm gonna take one of these guys, and then I get my own screw gun, and then I'm just gonna hold it up and then screw it in, just like that. Two down, I think I got 450 of them. Let's do this. <laughs> So we got done with the ceiling. Today we are working on installing the lift. But the first step is to take down this old attic stairs. The last guy who owned this house, he just kind of screwed it up. Uh, normally there's like a handle that you can just pull down on, but I'm gonna have to unscrew that and be kind of safe about it. Whoa! So I have to figure out how we're taking this out. I don't really know. Okay, ready? We're gonna take this bad boy down. Out with the old, and 
and in with the new. Okay, so we installed the two by four frame that this thing is gonna be sitting on. Now we have to pull this over and put it in. Ironically, I feel like that's the easier part. It's in! We're almost done! Okay guys, we got it completely installed. Let's see if it works. I think we're good! Oh yes! Fancy seeing you guys here. And now for the best part, Mike. When you pull it up, it matches the ceiling tile. So it's completely seamless. Where's the lift? I can't even see it. We can start moving everything in. Woo! Okay guys, I'm putting this bad boy to the test. I really hope this works. Oh! We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. It's working, it's working, it's working. And there we go! That's looking really good actually. Just do that with the entire wall. Okay guys, so now we are installing the pegboards. They're actually gonna be white pegboards. But first thing we have to do is install these little two by twos. Just like that, onto the wall. And then we're gonna put the, the pegboard right on there. Well, those are all done. Actually, I missed this wall. Dang it. Uh, okay, now it's time to hang the pegboards up. Now, it's time for the hard part. I had help before, but uh, they went home. So now, I'm gonna attempt to do this part by myself. I'm sure I'll be fine. Okay, and I'm all done with this wall. Okay guys, now for the next step, and that is to just organize all the random things that I have. Oh my goodness, so many random things. What do you do with these? What do you do with tiny elf legs? Okay guys, so now we are putting up the tools. We are putting them in alphabetical order, and we have the assistance of Tori DeBrant, she is directing us. Tori, where do we put uh, this circular saw? Uh, over there, in the beginning. Oh, uh, over here? Oh, we, okay, uh, sweet, thank you. What'd you say? What was that? You don't think the sink that I just installed into the Craft Corner Island will reach that far? Are you sure about that, buddy? All right, all right. I guess I do have my job and I'm dropping the job. Today is construction day with the boy. What was your name? I don't think I quite heard you. It's Robbie. I said it six times, dang it. So uh, basically, I, I just decided I want to put a bunch of rooms in my giant room. So in here, we got a brick wall. It's a big brick wall. It looks really good on here. So we got one set here, and then we got another set here. We got a set over there. We got a set over here. And then this is going to be our living room set over here. I'm really happy with all of it so far. You guys are holding all these bricks by yourself. Oh my god. <laughs> Before you screw that, make sure you're okay with this, this, this side. Oh, right. Wait, Robbie, is that a door? People call me humble, and this is my door, and this is my humble door. Not to be confused with Dumbledore. I'm feeling real humble right now because he's like, get hit. Like I said, it's a humble door. I'll see you later after being trapped. about a year and like four months later. We've changed everything up like six times and this is probably as complete as it's gonna get in a year and a half. So here it is, let me give you a little tour. Let's we'll start off with uh, the craft corner. So, um, you know, here's the classic Robbie's craft corner sign. Our saws, our sanding machine, this thing. Very dangerous. It says right here, uh, it's fine. Machine repair comes out of your paycheck. So we go over to here, um, you know, we have all of our tools and we got screws and bolts and uh, you know, no, I'm, a, I'm missing a few, a few, a few bolts, you know? <laughs> That's what people tell me! <laughs> Girl props. My good friend, my cart, I use this for everything. I had this at the other craft corner. You guys already saw this. The old desk. You guys have seen this desk. I've actually made an entire video where I made this desk from an old uh, crate that I got in the mail. Storage cubes over here. Anything we could need. If, uh, you need rubber bands? Here, take them. 
Okay. <laughs> okay. Anyway, then we go over to uh, my desk area. If you've seen this since I started doing my craft videos, it wasn't even a desk. It was just a piece of wood that I screwed into my wall. And I took that same piece of wood and I screwed it onto this very nice toolbox. All my tools, some more things, even more things. Things inside of the things. Things inside of the things, inside of the things. This thing also has things inside of that thing. Director's chair, you know, he directs everything. He does a great job. He's directing us right now. Shut up, anyway, okay. So we're gonna go through this door now. It's my closet. Just kidding, it's not a closet. It's my kitchen set, whoa! We actually decided to build an entire kitchen because I was just really tired of getting my kitchen at home dirty. We basically made everything from scratch. These tables, we had to finish them. We had to pour resin on it. Really proud of that. And as you guys saw before, it was all raw wood on the walls. We went in and uh, added walls. I hate to tell you guys that this brick is fake. <laughs> this brick is fake. However, we did install real cabinets. We have real snacks in here. Um, these are the snacks that we eat. We eat some of these. We don't eat hand sanitizer. Um, this sink is actually a real sink. See? That's real water. It's not CGI. This is real. <laughs> I think you should go. Anyway guys, back to the craft corner. There's something really cool I wanna show you guys in here. What we're gonna need to do is uh, go under here, we grab our stool, okay? Then we step up here. Excuse me, sir. And we got a secret hole! Well, I'll see you guys down the hole. And now we've made it to my basement set. As earlier said in the video, I installed myself a slide. This is where I store all my spooky paraphernalia, like my masks and uh, this hand. It's nice to meet you. Come up to my attic. Hey guys, welcome to my attic. It's currently um, like 135 degrees up here. It's 100 degrees outside and the attic just gets even hotter. As you guys can tell, uh, we're just kind of using the attic for storage. Uh, here's the old Christmas tree. This used to be 15 feet tall. Can you believe that? That's insane. But as you can tell, it's kind of a mess up here. Let's go back down to the basement. You guys are probably like, Robbie, what happened to your lift? And uh, the answer is, it's right next to my kitchen set, which is where we are again. We're in my closet kitchen set thing. If I ever want to use a lift, I just put this guy over. So if we ever want to use the lift, all we got to do is go and press this button right here. And it's as simple as that. Uh, that's how we use the lift. It's kind of slower than going up and down the stairs, but it's useful for heavy objects. But yeah, guys, this has been my one year update of me moving into this new craft corner. If you guys want more update videos or even videos of me doing these weird projects, let me know down in the comments down below. Also, make sure you give this video a big old thumbs up and turn on this one right down there. And I'll see you guys again real soon. Peace, love, and Wi-Fi. Oh, Renee! Okay, bye! Ah!